After you make this one big change to your gameplay, you'll realize what you were doing wrong. Let's go. See, that's why that's so important. So what am I even talking about? Now, this has to be by far the most overlooked asset that controller players have, but just don't simply use. And this is also probably one of the most important pieces of advice I can ever give. But instead of me just telling you, let me show you an example. Now, pretty often in Fortnite, you will find yourself in situations something like this, where you will have either an enemy behind this wall. And if you ever make an edit like this, you can't reset this edit unless you edit the stair and then reset the wall, or you have to pull your map out and then reset. And this is exactly what I'm talking about. Now, I know that sounds pretty obvious, but let me elaborate. So for an example, let's say that I have an opponent behind this wall and I take this wall and I want to get a nice right hand peek on my opponent. And once I shoot my opponent, the fastest way to be able to reset this is not going to be to look down to try to grab this edit. It's simply just to pull your map out before you reset. And I'll show you what that looks like in full speed. You can also use this for if you have somebody behind a triple edit and want to take a shot to reset from a whole entire box away. And this is really practical as well, because if you make a window edit and you take a shot and you go to take your map out to reset, you can instantly hold your wall so the opponent can't spray through or try to retake it. And if I was going to piece control somebody like this and I made this edit and want to take a shot, you can be looking anywhere in this vicinity and just pull your map out and hit your reset. You don't have to screw up your crosshair placement by coming all the way over here and then hitting reset. So if you like these short tutorials, make sure to hit that subscribe button.